Hey everybody, I'm here to introduce the design recipe. The design recipe is important to follow for any function rewrite. It's an easy six step process that when followed closely makes designing any function easy. Check out my other videos to see specific videos on certain steps. Let's say we were asked to design a function called add five, where when given any number adds five to it. The first step of the design recipe is the signature, which describes the input and output of the function. We know that this function has to take a number in order to add 5 to it, and adding 5 to any number will also output a number. Thus, the signature is number to number. The second step of the design recipe is the purpose statement. A simple one-line comment will suffice here. Then, the third step is writing examples. These examples can simply describe inputs and outputs, but writing them in the form of tests makes it easier to test our function later. The fourth step of the design recipe is writing a template. Here I've written the template for this specific function. The fifth step of the design recipe is to code. We now code the function with all the information we have accumulated in the first four steps. We can copy and paste our template to make this easier. It's that easy. The final step of the design recipe is to debug. Since our initial tests pass, everything looks good, but for the debugging steps, it is better to write more tests and to check every case. I hope this short video on the design recipe helped, and until next time.